With our co-host Lindsay Lohan, who just set things off with a live performance out here. Oh. How did you feel? It was amazing. It was so cool. I never thought that I'd be doing that, so I just went for it. I had fun. Yeah, what was the energy of the crowd like to perform in front of? Amazing. It's nerve-wracking at first because we were waiting there for a little bit, and I was like, can we go, can we go, can we go? Uh -huh. And I got so out of breath because I was singing so much and trying to dance and move, Confetti but it was Confetti was flying in your face? I know. It went in my mouth. I'm like pulling it out. Have you ever been in the middle of a crowd like this before? No, I've never been in Times Square for New, for New Year's Eve. So. All right, nice. We'll take it all in. <laughs> and all the people around us are people that have come from all over for the biggest part of the year. This huge crowd can actually watch the whole MTV show on the world's largest high-definition screen way up there. And for the very first time, MTV has given out our digits, a phone number for people to call in and listen to our program. So nobody's left out in the cold in more ways than one. Uh, we're just getting things started here tonight. There's so much more to come from Green Day to Snoop, Jimmy Fallon, Jimmy Eat World. So don't go away. MTV's ice out New Year's Eve 2005 so we'll keep doing it for you. Okay? Happy New Year. What's up, love? Yeah, you know, you gotta keep it iced out, gotta oh, keep it real. Man. Real quick, Lindsay, I gotta tell you, you, you rocked it. You yeah, did your it was, it, was, uh, it was so much fun. <laughs> When I listen to all you guys at home, I gotta tell you, Lindsay and I have been joined by one of the superstars who's got a very special performance planned for us tonight when he does New York. So please, of course, show some love and welcome to our Ice Out Party, Mr. Down Roll. What's up, John? Holla. What's going on, Lindsay? Right, listen, what's going on? Well, you know, you know, I, I like that you came prepared in attire and all you iced out for show. You know, for I, I, try to, I try to oblige the situation. But listen, know? now we're all here for New Year's Eve and we're ringing in the New Year's, so forget about 2004. We're talking about 2005. What do you plan on doing in 2005 that you've never done before? This is a hard question. Yeah, this is a hard this question. This is all you. Um, I don't know, maybe um, relaxing. Relax. I ah. haven't relaxed in a long time. <laughs> well, we are not going to relax tonight, that's for sure. We, what else no, we got going tonight. on, Lindsay? This is New Year's Eve. We're chilling. We're hanging out. We're celebrating the New Year, 2005. Absolutely. All right, Hillary and Caduce are standing by with a guy who might be the only guest younger than me tonight, so let's go and check it out. What's going on? Thanks a lot, you guys. <laughs> All right, you guys, it's New Year's Eve in the coolest city in the world. And since our party is on the rock, we went ahead and brought in Joe Ice. Joe Ice is an ice sculpture right there. Look at, look at that. That's fine craftsmanship. That's some serious work. We got to ice it out all the way from the bling. Thanks, Jacob, the jeweler, by the way. Two. <laughs> the ice sculpture. Anyways, welcome back to the frostiest party in town, MTV's Ice Out New Year's Eve 2005. I am Vanessa here, of course, with Miss Lindsay Lohan. Now, Lindsay, I gotta ask you, do you ever get so caught up in just thinking about what your New Year's resolution should be that instead you just think of what other people should do? Oh, yeah, it's so much easier because you can, it's hard to think of a New Year's resolution. All right, so, so let's think of what we can tell other people to do for their New Year's resolution. I thought of people to maybe stop spreading rumors. Stop my spreading thought. rumors. Rumors are not fun. It's <laughs> drama. Nobody wants drama in their lives. Just want to live life to its fullest. Absolutely. Listen to the girls' music. Well, thank you so much to MTV and Aquafina. Celebrities don't have to waste their time thinking up their own New Year's resolutions. We posted choices online, and you voted on what the biggest names in entertainment should do in 05. People like Jessica Simpson, Usher, and Snoop, of course, all were on that. Later, of course, we we're going to check out some of the results and share your top choices on live TV. But right now, we're going to go check in with Hillary. So let's we're go check in with Hillary. What's going on? What up? Take it all in, everybody. Take it all in. These are the sights and sounds of Times Square in New York City. The home office for New Year's Eve, of course, every year. Welcome back to MTV's Ice Out Party. Right here, Vanessa, hanging out with Lindsay Lohan. It's, of course, New Year's Eve 2005, live from the only 10 blocks that matter. I'm hanging out here with Lindsay. Listen, I have been to my share of parties this year, but tonight is the 100th anniversary of the first Times Square celebration, and it's the ultimate one ultimate. and only party. you got to be here. You heard it right here yourself from the girl. i got to say, oh, no, you're, it's going you're, down. You're a triple threat. Lindsay, you're a triple threat. Thank you. Like, you sing, you act, you're hot. Actually, you're like a quadruple threat because you're, you're single, too, so that makes it like... Oh, my just <laughs> ah, like everywhere. Anyways, I want you to know that people have been logging on to MTV.com, of course, to tell us what certain celebs should have as resolutions this year. For instance, personally, I think that Damien just needs to come out of the closet and admit that he's a Yankee oh. fan. No, not the closet like okay. that. Not nice. Admit he's a Yankees fan. Like, don't be a bandwagon jumper. Don't just pull for Boston Goodger from there. I'm just playing. I love you, Damien. Love you. We you love know, you, Damien. No hard anyway. feelings whatsoever. <laughs>
<laughs> we're just playing. We're going to take a look at what our viewers' recommendations for our online poll are. We can start with Mr. Yeah. Of course you know him. Uh, sure. 90% sure. said his 2005 resolution should boil down to four simple words. What are they, Lindsay? Yeah. Part two. Part two. Record yeah, part two. Record yeah, part two. That's four words. <laughs> Record yeah, part two. Anyways, 20% said Usher should just keep his shirt on. What do you think about that? I think he should keep his shirt off. body show it Anyways, off. Like do it. your thing. And a huge 61% of our online jury weighed in to urge Usher to challenge Justin Timberlake to a dance off. That's just drama. No, that's pay per view, girl. That's that is not drama. I'll check it out. That's pay per view. But right now, let's just bring in another performance. We are ringing in the new year, and we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it right. We are. We got Fat Joe. We got Ja Rule. And you know what? I say that this is definitely the anthem for the year. Lindsay, what is this? New York. Do your thing, fellas. This is all yours. <laughs> Lindsay Lohan is here with us right now, and we are just overlooking. Times Square right we here. We are. <laughs> Take a look at this sign out here. Lindsay Lohan, I came from Ohio to meet you, written on a giant piece of cardboard. That's really flattering. Does that make your New Year's a little sweeter? It's a really nice feel. This is very surreal, this whole scene. And uh, uh, check this out. All the people with all the things on the air with the gold. Yeah, they've got those uh, air balloons that they're throwing around. It's like a sea of people. It really is. It's terrific. There's some <laughs> naked people out there, too. That's okay, America. We won't show you them. Uh, we've got you here right now. And since we do have you here, you know, you're all over the tabloids. You're like the new it girl. You're the gossip girl. Everyone's gossiping about you. <laughs> and all the guys uh, that, that you date and stuff. So what I gotta ask you, what is your your favorite type of guy? Is there a prototype out there? Um, I guess it just depends on the personality, and if, as long as you can trust the person, that's the most important. If you can trust them, sure. And there's no lies in the relationship. But yeah, it doesn't matter what kind of person. They and are you willing if someone comes up to you on the street and has a nice face and a good personality? Are you willing to go? You know what? Hey, let's go to Fridays and get like a blooming onion or something. <laughs> yeah, I might feel a little uncomfortable at first if I just met them on the street. Right, and, and it's like a red lobster. But I'm pretty spontaneous. Yeah. Maybe. All right, it's all good. Anyway, uh, 2004 busy year for Jennifer Lopez. You know, Jennifer Lopez tied the knot. My goodness, Mark that, Anthony. That they're they're cute. Though. They are a cute couple. I'm a J Lo fan. And she took some time off too from her honeymoon. Went back to the studio to record a new album. It's called Rebirth. Even though the CD doesn't hit stores until March, we have a special New Year's treat for you. An exclusive sneak peek at the first video here. It's called Get Right. Uh, but why take it from me? Jennifer herself wants to bring it to you. Check this out. Hey, what's up, everybody? I know